In today's guide, I will put you through on how to use CapCut on iPhone. CapCut is a video editing software or application. You can also use it to edit a photo. But in this guide, I'm going to walk you through on how you can use it to edit your video. The first step is to install the application. So tap on App Store. As the App Store app opens, tap search and then search for CapCut. Hit the search button. Now the app has been installed on my device. But if it has not been installed, the button you will see is get. So tap on get button and complete the installation. Now that CapCut has been installed on my iPhone, the next step is to start making use of it. So I will tap on the app. The next step you need to take is to import the video you want to edit in it. So I will tap on. So tap create new project. Then these are the videos here. And the one I want to work with is the first on this list. So I will tap on the video. After that, tap add. The video is now imported into CapCut. And here at the bottom here is the timeline. So I will play the video and then start editing it. This tutorial, we are going to learn. So when I get to a part I want to cut off, maybe at that point, I didn't say anything reasonable. All I need is to pause, okay? So as I pause, I'll tap edit button, then tap split. Then I'll play again my until I get to where I want to stop, okay? So I will tap on split again. Now this video has been split and this part here, I don't need it. So what I do is I will tap on it for it to be selected. Then to delete that part, I will tap delete okay you can see that part has gone because i don't need it you may like to add animation in your video and how you do that is using the animation tab so to add animation tap on edit and select animation now choose any of these animations oh, and you will see how it will oh, impact so on your video you can see how it's changing the look of the video but in this case i don't need any animation so i'll go back to none you can increase the volume of your video through the timeline so at the point when you're editing and you feel that the volume is low you can increase that are you getting it so what you need is tap on edit okay then you scroll down to volume tap on the volume by default, the volume is placed at 100%. So if you want to get more than that, just increase. And once you increase that, as the line, as the number goes up, the volume level increases, okay? So when you say it, you will notice that the volume is higher than before. On iPhone. As you can see, the so volume is higher. So, but let me return it back to 100, all right? Okay, wrong. here we are on the 100 on. mark, okay? Text can be used to explain your video, okay? For example, if you want to tell your um, viewers to subscribe, you can decide to add text, okay? For you to add text, what you need is tap on the text tab. As you tap on the text tab, select the option add text. So tap the word you want to have on the video. So let's say subscribe, all right? After that, tap on this good button, all right? But if you notice, you can see that this text has the front color as white and it doesn't match very well to the video, okay? So what you need to do is that as the text is selected already, tap on, as, tap on style, okay? So this gives you some colors you can choose. 
so i can go with the black one and you can see that change the text color okay after you have done editing your video the next step you are likely to take is to export your video okay that is to save it in your iphone for you to do that tap on this arrow at the top right that points upward okay so this will export your video within just few seconds and once that export is done and once the exporting is done what you need is get to your iphone photo section and you will see the file then for example once i click here the file is here already so these are just the few steps you need to take to use CapCut on your iphone i hope this video helps please if it does hit the like button subscribe to my channel and leave a comment see you some other time